This episode of Stuck in Vermont is made possible by Hotel Vermont and Vermont Tourism. Hey, all right, get it on that one. Stuck in Vermont, brought to you by Seven Days. My name's Ava Solberger, and we are here in Waterbury, and behind me is the Alchemist Can Sale. Everybody loves the sunshine. Thank you for bringing the sunshine. It's awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Come on! Woo. There you go. Thank you very much. John has a custom blend. He has a couple kegs. He's going around giving some samples. It's a blend of the Beals above folk. Topper. In a deep meditative state right now. <laughs> Thank you, sir. May I have another? Enjoy your beer. Oh, you can sure that. Long lines of people from all over the place here for the beer. It's just beer gas and weekend. Oh, beer Mageddon in Waterbury this weekend. This is the beer of Palooza. I'm calling it my beer occasion in Vermont. Beer Memorial Day. Beer that one I'm into. There's just going to be a lot of people that are going to be here for some of the best beer in the world. I'm happy to get anything because all the beer is awesome. We've been from brewery to brewery all weekend and it's just like, it's always our favorite, whichever's in our hand. Vermont's known for its craft beer scene and here in Waterbury, as some people call it, with the Alchemist and up in Greensboro, we've got Hill Farms and out in Warren, we've got Lawson's Finest. So many people travel up and start at Warren's store um, on Route 100, then they'll drive up through this area, come visit the IPA Highway. So today, the crowds are enjoying a little bit of everything. We got here at 9 a.m. 4 a.m. Well, we got here 7. I mean, we we did the Lawson's thing this morning. We've been we here, here since like 10 in the morning. We've been here since 3 hours. You guys have been here since what? 9 o'clock? 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock this morning. 8 o'clock this morning. 8 o'clock. Uh, because I knew there was going to be a huge crowd. I just had to be a part of it. What drew you? Awesome beer. <laughs> beer. Exceptional beer. I'm here because you're having a little beer craziness up here this weekend. So we came up because we went the Lawson sale. Then we're coming to here, hoping to get some Hill Farm set in town. In Waterbury. Hill Farmstead Brewery is celebrating their four-year anniversary and they're doing a tap takeover at Prohibition Pig, the Blackback, and the Reservoir. Sean Hill's my hero. Happy anniversary, Sean. It's really cool that they're kind of taking over a couple of the bars in town and taking over all the taps. 20 taps. 20 taps, probably. There are people who have been waiting in line for hours to get the Alchemist's Focal Banger and Bub. We're having a pop-up sale. We're selling a bunch of new beer out of our truck. These events kind of give us the hints of what we used to have at the pub. We found out a few weeks ago that all this other stuff was going on, and it, it's worked out great. I don't know how many people are lined up now. I would think a couple hundred. I'm ready for our free hot dogs. <laughs> so we'll sell out. We've sold out for every sale. Over in Waitsfield, Lawson's Finest is selling their Triple Sunshine IPA for the very first time. The Lawson's that line was pretty crazy this morning. If you came by 7.30, there was about 300 people across the street at the Mad Taco waiting. Number eight in line. I only got triple sunshine. Everything else was out, but that's what I came for, so. They turned away 140 people. No, we are completely out of beer. I can never make the beer fast enough to keep it on the shelf. I was over in Waitsfield waiting for my ticket for Lawson's this morning. Now I'm waiting in line for some Hill Farmstead. I'm sure I'll be waiting in line over there with everyone else in line here about 1 o'clock, 2.30, waiting for the Alchemist. That's a lot of beer in one day. You haven't seen my basement. <laughs> <laughs> the great thing about Waterbury is you can try beer from all over the state. Just between these three places, there's always a ton of really good beer on town. Lawson I've definitely awesome. gotten lost and awesome already <laughs> by like 5 a.m. <laughs> intensity that people love beer is surprising. I like to refer to myself as a beer geek. I like high quality beverages. It's just about people coming out and blowing off a little steam and having fun for a couple hours. You come prepared. It's like camping. They said to dress up in costumes, so I did. I got my main shoes on, I got my umbrella, but I got a chair to sit. I think most people know beer in general in Vermont is pretty stellar. It's skill, it's passion, and it's love. Yeah. Oh, Tim! Oh, Half the really line friendly. for the first 50 people are Pennsylvanians. <laughs> Alexandria, New Hampshire. Boston area. Pennsylvania. Connecticut. Yeah. Yeah. It's cool to see all these people from New Hampshire, Massachusetts. Boston. We drove straight here to this. Bethlehem, PA. Connecticut. People from Arizona, people from New Jersey. These Vermonters don't want to stand in this. We live three blocks we away. Three blocks. Burlington. It's down the Rutland area. I'm from Connecticut. A couple of beer friends have flown from California. It's you, really you, become you, a destination, I think. It's a testament to Vermont beer with the fact that you see people from so far away. You've seen people from like Georgia, you've seen people from <laughs> Illinois. Collectively, Vermont craft brewers make such great beer that it's really worth someone's time to travel here. Parts of Virginia. There's a fellow who came from Michigan. 
But these are the people we see every month. They come for the can releases at The Alchemist. They come for Sean's releases or parties. All we see on the license plates at Hill Farmstead. And it's nice to be exposed to Vermont, have an opportunity to come up here and sort of enjoy the natural beauty here. And they're willing to get up at, in the dark and travel a long ways or be here and spend the whole weekend and go out to the restaurants and fill up the inns. I think it's a great way to boost Vermont's economy in a different way. Alchemists, Lawson's, everything around here is just incredible. Yeah, How can you choose? It's, it's like, like, it's like you're picking your favorite mom and kid. sister. You love them all. That's right. Come on. Vermont beer is better than California beer. What? <laughs> Neither, but we love Vermont. <laughs> you know, the past couple years, it's blowing up. It's ridiculous. Several breweries opening every year. You know, the state makes it like Vermont. Yeah. People are certainly passionate about craft beer. The craft beer scene around here is very tight knit. Sean Hill, Sean Lawson, John Kimmich make some of the best beers in the world. It's an art. I wish I knew what they knew. To be able to make a beer like this, you're gifted. Every time I brew my own beer, I get sad when I drink it. When they take the beers from these breweries to Europe, they don't want other American beers. They say, Joe, send IPAs and stouts from Vermont because they're the best beers that we have. You know, we're friends with all of the brewers in Vermont. It's a family. I mean, everybody's got friends that work at a brewery someplace. Both Sean's are very good friends. We all get along great. We drink each other's beer. It's great. We're really focused on keeping the company small for now. It's at our house, so we don't have any retail or tours of the brewery. And think about it, Sean's a one-man band. The guy makes the beer, bottles the beer, kids and wife help him label. Someday my back will give out. <laughs> it's just me and Jen doing what we do. It's great to be part of the craft beer community. I mean, that's really what it's all about, is just getting this sense of community again, which is gone since we don't have our retail room and we don't have the pub. And... Everybody was so fearful after the flood, like we're going to be a ghost town. So we're just doing our thing, making beer all the time, and you lose sight of what's going on out there. And this is what's going on out there. Local Heady Topper, Beazma Blend. The aroma is great. The hops come through very nicely. This is just like a step above everything else. Everett. Society and solitude. Worth the tragedy, for sure. Yeah. Abner's also very good. Cotillion. The Petite Mutant. Convivial. I like to get the Edward Fairley off in. Yeah, I guess he names them after philosophical works or okay. something. Family names, so I think that's kind of unique. We're really excited for La Saracen. It's a new beer that they're releasing today, actually. I'm excited about the triple. It was one of the few beers that I can just credit the fans of saying, you make double sunshine, you're going to make triple sunshine? So good. Delicious. Yeah. I haven't Absolutely had a chance to delicious. open mine yet. Yeah. I need to sit down and <laughs> put it in the the little glass I got and take it all in in silence. <laughs> it's just a great place to be. It's just the beginning. Don't save all your money to buy a bigger yacht. Don't spend your time obsessing over things you haven't got. Six foot down, don't pay no mind. New fortune looks so fame. When a hundred years go by, it's time it all ends the same. Smoky Frog, a head and topper in a can. If you got someone to grab, then do it every chance you can. Drink that Smoky Frog, a head and topper in a can. If you got someone to grab, then do it every chance you can. Have you had a beer yet? And now I'm going to taste the Alchemist mixture of Bezelbub and Focal Banger because after a long day of shooting, I earned this. Oh, delicious. We'll get stuck with you again real soon. Cheers. I think you should drive us home, actually. <laughs> no. <laughs> Vermont does it best. Okay. Cheers! Mm. There's like a spider on the... Look at that, there's a spider. <laughs> Hotel Vermont is personal, purposeful, and natural. Rustic and modern. Unique, independent, and unlike anything else. It's fun, it's exciting, hip and relaxed. It's Vermont, it's Burlington. Come down for a beer, come stay overnight, we'd love to see you.